this record in another sort of way, even though it's the same lineup as com coming up, it's because we've been away for ten years. It did feel like another debut, and we wanted it to have that kind of freshness, yeah. you know. It's a very tricky record to make this. I think it's very hard to be away um, for 10 years and come back and the first few things you write to be amazing. I think, you know, we were very careful that um, uh, we didn't just fall into that trap of just assuming that everything was good that we wrote. And I think we wrote a lot of songs for the album and discarded a lot of songs and really questioned whether what we were doing was good enough or not. And there was a point making the record where we decided, well, we didn't actually decide, but we were kind of like, well, but, mm, you know, do we really want to do this? Is this working? And then it kind of that just sort of started falling into place. And uh, we, there was a tipping point where we, where we kind of like, oh, okay, now we've kind of got a record now. Writing Barriers was a real tipping point, actually. For some reason, it just sort of um, it really hit this real sweet spot between kind of sounding like suede but not sounding like self-parody and sounding, sounding fresh enough. Suddenly we wrote that song and it felt, OK, we've got a record here. We're starting to get a record, you know. So that was quite an important track for me. Yeah. Kisses and lipstick traces Laminate sets in Belgian rooms Cut and replace the grace Of notions that clung to me When I clung to you a lot of the whole process over the last couple of years, getting back together again and making a new record has been part of our motivation, has been to sort of like, um, to rewrite history a little bit, you know, and to, I think it kind of all ended in a, in a, you know, we didn't end on a high, we kind of made our, our weakest record and it all sort of fizzled out in the wrong way and I think it, it was very much a, a sense of us wanting to say, you know, to sort of like, you know, just to sort of like kind of, I don't know, just to sort of rewrite that a bit, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, it's not like, it's not like... I think the thing with the last record and the last tour is it was kind of competent and dull, and it's exactly the things I hate about music, really. You know what I mean? The, the things I love about music are, are when it's extreme and odd and complicated and beautiful. And, and it was just the sense that throughout the life of Suede, it, we'd had our ups and downs and we'd been great and awful, but it'd never been boring. And just that we'd, we'd, finished, we'd finished boring. I look at that last record and I listen to it and I look at the sleeve and stuff and I'm just like, it's, it's not right, it, it, it's, it's not the place that, that it can finish. And with this, I'm just, I know that however it gets received or whatever, we finish with something that I think is beautiful and interesting and complex and, you know, all those things. Jump, jump, jump.